So let's suppose you're trying to take a bunch of images and composite them together. Well, instead of dragging the images and making a bunch of layers in a single file, what you can do is do it really simply by using a little script. Now, in the past in Photoshop, we've been able to come to File, Scripts, and you can see something called Load Files into Stack. You can also do this within Adobe Bridge. But now we can actually also do it within Mini Bridge. Now, this is Photoshop CS5. And if you guys do have CS4, you can do it just the way I showed you in the file menu. But in CS5, I can choose a series of images here that I want to composite together, let's say. And then come to this little button right here called Tools, Photoshop, and you'll see it says Load Files into Photoshop Layers. Now, like I said, you can do the same thing in Adobe Bridge if you go to the Tools menu and see there. But if I choose this, it's going to open up a uh, an image here and just load it in, if you notice. So it's going to kind of do its thing. Now, let me, let me do this. Let me go back over to the Layers panel. And you can see down here, if I move the layers up, that they are each in a separate layer. So it's a really simple script, you guys. It just basically kind of pops these on top of each other. Now, if we, let me close this. If we had done this script, if you take a look up here, under Scripts and File, Load Files into Stack, you'd see something a little different here. We can actually load a bunch of images into a stack. We can choose ones that are already open. We can browse for them. We can grab a whole folder. And we can also turn them into smart objects, which is kind of cool. So it's a little bit different, uh, but a similar concept. So anyway, I just wanted to show you that. It's really pretty easy. I use it a lot for just trying to composite images, put them together. But that's just using a little script inside of Photoshop.